Hey, what's up guys? What's up challengers? Um, I wanted to make this video uh, to show a few different uh, exercise alternatives. Uh, so as you as we're getting into the more strenuous time now, uh, thanks, th thanks William. <laughs> you, did, you did awesome on this and I'm excited for it. So thank you for doing that, number one, because it, like I said, it's motivated me uh, to continue on and to do more. Uh, so I, I thank you for that because I was I was lethargic. I was you know sitting around I'm not really sitting around, but I was working and doing other things and not really taking care of myself exercise wise. And that, that's super important, not only for my clarity, but now I'm working faster. I'm doing better uh, with my family and doing better with everything in my life. And that's what this working out does for me. And I, I just chose not to in the past for the past few months. So <clears throat> thanks, William, for putting this together. And now I'm back into my routine. That's fantastic. Uh, so, and I need you guys, and I thank you guys for continuing on your path because that supports me. So thank you guys. So as we get into it, I'm going to do some modifications uh, for the push-up and plank challenge. Uh, so as we get into it, um, now, it's never about just uh, following through and completing everything 100% the way it's supposed to be perfectly done. Not everybody can do that, and quite honestly, we're not all athletes. Uh, so, and we're all building up to that. Uh, just building up to our next step, next level. And uh, some of us don't want to be athletes, and that's okay, just functional. Uh, so that's where we're going to head to functional so that we can live our life the way we want to live it. So uh, getting into that. Now, if you're doing full-fledged push-ups, uh, which is fantastic. Let's see if I can get down here and show you. So got my a little bit of my counter there. All right. So full-fledged push-ups. We'll see if I do this right. But uh, basically you want to have your hands underneath your shoulders. Your, your ankles are pushed back on your toes. And your butt is... You're ba basically wanting to be like a board, a flat board. And then you go straight down, bringing the elbows back. Going straight down. And then back up. You don't want to be doing this. And you don't want to be doing this. That, no doing that stuff. That's going to hurt your back. It's, it's not proper form. It's going to hurt you more than help you, and it's going to work different muscles. So, flat as a board. Now, if you want to change that and you get tired, go down to your knees. Push. Push. Going down. Keeping the upper body straight as possible. All right. Now, uh, if that is too much, what we're going to do here. Hello, there you are. What we're going to do here is if that's too much, what we're going to do is come over to the wall. And I have a mirror here. I don't want to push on that, but start up high. And if that, if up high is uh, not enough, you go down lower. And then you bring your feet out further. And you use the wall in incremental levels for yourself. So using the wall, uh, high, easier, the lower you go, and the further your legs out, obviously harder. So that's uh, for the push-ups. That's a different way you can do that. Now let's get into the planks. So planking, as you all know, you all know a very good plank, I'm sure. But I'll do it anyhow. Plank is simply the top of a push-up. Hands under the shoulders, butt. Basically, you want to squeeze your butt nice and tight, pushing back your ankles as much as you can. That's going to get your body in basic form for holding it straight upright. All right? And then you're going to squeeze the abs, squeeze the butt, holding that level. Again, no butt up and no butt down. Straight as a board, getting that body in there. Now, if you struggle with this, what we're going to do, we're going to go down to the elbows. Again, keeping the butt straight. Elbows under the arms and holding that position. All right? If that becomes too, too much for you, honestly, go down to your knees. That's okay. Either here and then come back up. Here. And then come back up. I'd prefer you to, for you to stay as long as you can. Possibly hold it uh, all the way up. 
But hey, if we need to take breaks, we need to take breaks. That's what gets us better. So by the end, you'll be doing more than you ever anticipated. Now, uh, we may have a goal uh, set on that sheet. And not all of us may, may reach that. And most of us will. And that's okay. And if we do, we don't do. And if we don't, we don't. The best thing is, though, where you started, track where you started and, where, and write down what was hard for you. And as you go throughout the 30 days, you're going to notice that you're doing way more um, at that first point when you write down, this was pretty hard. You're going to be able to do that and say, wow, this is actually not so hard. And how cool is that? So it's not really, the goal is not to focus on what's going on with my goal. Like, yeah, we can set some pretty high goals sometimes. And the best thing is we're making progress regardless. So it doesn't, it doesn't have to be re, uh, progress in the way of um, reaching, attaining that specific set out goal. The best thing is, is that you're actually doing this and you're making progress. That's, that's the one beauteous key of all of this is remembering, always remembering that you're making progress. And we're all in practice for the rest of our lives. And everything that we do, everything that we do, we're in practice. We're never going to arrive. We're never going to be the best at everything. But we're in practice, so that means we can mess up, right? Awesome. So if we're in practice, let's just continue to make steps forward together. So thanks, guys, for watching, and I hope this helps you in any point uh, for your uh, – uh, what am I thinking here? <laughs> for your adjustments to your exercises. And uh, you guys are going to make it all the way through. It's going to be awesome. Thank you guys for being a part of the group, and I'm excited to see what happens throughout the 30 days. Peace. Have a great day.